Hello, today I'm here to do the January 2020 edition of Paleo News. Now to start off with, world's oldest preserved digest digestive tracts, 550 million years old, which was slightly before the beginning of, right before the beginning of the Cambrian. Back when there was mostly soft body creatures. Now that is pretty sin one out of many significant discoveries. And another one, world's oldest known species of scorpions named Yeah, sorry, Eurypterids don't actually count. They're not real scorpions, actually. They're technically more closely related to horseshoe crabs. But anyway, named Paris Scorpio Venator from 437 million years ago during the early Silurian. And a new species of Allosaurus. Allosaurus Gemadcini from Utah and northeastern Why? from northeastern Utah and Wyoming. And oldest known fungi remains at 715 million years old. So basically during the cryogenian during or in that case during the during the height of Earth's the longest and worst ice age Earth had ever gone through. Or since then. I mean, wow, a lot of stuff being from before the Cambrian explosion so far this, this past month being from or in that case, before some of the earliest hard shell creatures from what we know first evolved. Now that's pretty significant. I mean, it, it couldn't be any more significant than that. And last but not least, a close relative to Velociraptor from China that lived 120 million years ago, right after, say, Microraptor and Cynorphosaurus living in the same part of the world when ex lived or when extinct. Called Wulong Bohiensis. And that ter that was even very would have probably even been very similar in appearance to Velociraptor too. Though back a couple decades ago, it would have been presumed over time. Though sure, many of them would have been that that they would have evolved to become smaller and smaller over time. But anyway, well, that's it for today, but as usual, thanks for watching, leave a like, and subscribe to watch more content on this channel every day. But from now on, thanks for watching.